I'm getting chills when they tell me you're not yourself Trying to move but it's hard, I'm out of Welcome back to my channel you guys today. I'm gonna to be showing you how I repurpose my Bath and Body Works candles So here is everything that I'm going to be using today I got those candlestick holders from the Dollar Tree as well as that mirror tray and these little um, Acrylic gems and then I just have some Gorilla Glue and I got these knobs from Walmart, but of course you can get knobs from anywhere. I often like to get my knobs from uh, Marshalls or Home Goods because they come in a pack of six, and I usually get them for around like seven or eight bucks. So here are the three um, candles I'm gonna be using. And the first step, you guys, is to put them in the freezer overnight. So they don't necessarily have to go in um, overnight, but I like to put mine in overnight because it's, um, makes the wax come out much easier but as long as you have it in there for several hours you should be okay okay so the first step is to get the candle and I have a butter knife and I'm just basically going to um, try to break the wax pretend to dream surrounded by ghosts in Once you've removed all the wax from your jars, um, and you guys, I, all I do, these usually just come out. So try to, the goal is to try to break up your wax into pieces um, to get them to come out. And usually these little wick um, holders, they'll, they're metal and they're held down, down by glue. Usually they'll come out with the wax. And if they don't, you could just easily pop them out with your butter knife or you can um, soak them with white distilled vinegar. But nevertheless, once you're done with everything, all you have to do is clean your jars. That's what we're going to do next. And um, to take off the bottom, well, two of these I don't need to really worry about taking off the bottom. One of them I am going to. Um, but if you're having a problem taking it off, you can soak it in uh, hot water for about five minutes. And then you can take the residual off with coconut oil. Once everything is, all the uh, jars are clean and dried out, the next step I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some Gorilla Glue. And I'm just going to line the candle holder. And I'm gonna be pretty generous with it because I really want it to, to last. And then for the knobs, you guys, um, you could always use your drill and actually screw them, um, you know, down into here. But I have this Gorilla Glue and this works very well. So I'm just going to use this. And once again, I'm just going to try to center it. Maybe you leave me here. Whatever happens when the storms are here. I decided to go ahead and add some bling to the bottom the this set is for my mom so I wanted to make it you know a little extra special and bling it out for her a little bit um, for it to do that I'm just gonna be using my hot glue gun and I'm gonna be using these gorilla glue sticks and if you haven't used these you should because these these hold really really well side note you guys I do not get rid of 
the, I don't know if I said this before or not, <laughs> I don't get rid of the wax, I go ahead and I set it aside and I use this in my wax warmer. I have seen people like melt down the wax and put it in um, an ice tray to make it like a cube form, you know, to make it a lot um, nicer than just looking like this, but I really don't care because um, it's just gonna melt down anyway. So I just go ahead and save this and repurpose the rest of the wax as well. Here's the finished product and I absolutely love the way it came out. I know my mom is going to love it. And then clearly she can put whatever she wants inside but I went ahead and put some Q-tips, cotton balls, and some makeup sponges in here. And then here's just another example of a way that you can repurpose the candles. I use these for uh, clearly my makeup brushes. You could also just use it as a filler um, just to put some decorative uh, anything in here you guys. You could do um, rocks and succulents. You could do um, the artificial snow during Christmas time. You could put grass and a candle. Just the sky is the limit. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please be sure to do so. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you can know when I upload future videos. And until next time, everybody, bye. It's not easy but I'm feeling stronger